Morning, Pecky. Morning, Chino. Welcome to Vail, Colorado, the center of the Shred universe right now for the 2019 Burton U.S. Open. You know, we talk about the U.S. Open. This is the, the most historic event in all of snowboarding. When you win this event, your name is permanently legendary for snowboarding for years and years to come. Good. I know a lot of you like to drop a little bit lower from the banners and the red book things, but just wait for uh, Jay here to let you go. Yeah. No, it's good. You had a good build up today. So keep the language to uh, minimum. When you're riding like this, I love watching it. Yeah. Yo, big guy, you got a sec? Yeah, what's up? I uh, just want to kind of like. Basically set the tone, you know, we're, we're about to, you know, completely just dominate the season with a six for six, you know, undefeated. You're working hard. You know, I feel like I'm working hard. Everybody else involved is working hard, but still, I just feel like. You're talking about Quentin, not you. <sighs> yeah, man, it just, I, I mean, I love the guy so much. He means well. It's just coming up short, you know, we're just. He's been there for me from the start. I'm not, yeah, I'm not saying we should get rid of him or whatever, we just need to bring him up to our level. You know, I want you to have that extra, that extra oomph of like off-hill support, you know, like we got this one more contest and we got plans for the summer and spring and going into the next year and where nobody's letting off the gas, you know, and you know, it's just, it's just business. We're all working really hard, so. Okay, so we're literally jumping at anything here, so what are our options and don't hold back? No, it's not that. It's more, he doesn't like the taste of the cereal. He'll feel uncomfortable doing it on TV, I promise. We're dealing with athletes here. They're very emotional creatures. Karen, he's not a social media influencer. He actually influences people to do meaningful things with their life. You know, if you want him to post a picture up of his morning chia seed pudding and smashed avocado and use the hashtag Kitspo, that ain't gonna happen. No, that's great. That's a great direction for the company, Karen. Yeah. No, good on you. Okay, goodbye. Now these, these athletes dedicate their lives to their sports. You know, they train hard, they eat well, they do everything. And it's to compete and put on a good show for us. All these Fruit Loops care about is whether or not they posted a pic of their latest latte on Instagram. You know? I've had it up to pussies both. It's a rhyme, actually. Quinton, what are you doing? This is like you're all upset. What's going on? Well, it's, it's the LA stuff and steel and the presentation didn't go well. I just... I... Is Scotty with steel? No. So you're still his manager? Yeah. So what are you doing? I don't know, I was just going to keep... Trying. No, you need to get off your butt and go over to US Open. 
Well, I can't just leave and just leave everyone here. Just left We're their fine. Own we can sort it out ourselves. Don't worry. We've got it all covered. So you want me to just go? Yes, just go. Get out of here. Why are you even still here? I better book my flights then. I've already booked them for you. Welcome back to Vail, Colorado. Day two of the US Open of snowboarding presented by Burton. And today we have men's half pipe semifinals. The field is stacked. We have so many young riders coming up, all trying to chase the undefeated Scotty James. And that is why he's undefeated this season. What happened, man? I just lost 20 bucks. I told them Scotty was going to get a 91. He posted an 87, dog. Well, I mean, you're the wax guy. Let's just go a little faster then. I'm going to put a 91 this Yeah, right. Excuse me, sir. Sir. You need a proper credential to be filming in this zone? Can I see it? Uh, He basically, if it's just Uto, if Uto gets a higher score, I want Scotty qualifying first just in case the weather comes in. So if, he, if Uto scores over him, then Scott's got a couple more things he can do. So I don't want him to with this wind. I don't want him to do it at all. But I'm also not giving it away or letting him give it away. You have one new voice message. Scotty, the best. Just remember, Scotty, in this sport, the earning window is it's pretty small. Okay, your window is wide open. Money, girls, plural, baby. <laughs> you got my number. Scott, why don't you get in here and buckle up, bud? Is that ready to go? Yeah. Okay. You do you. You do it better than anybody else. Yeah. One run at a time, Scott. Come on, Scott. Uh, Mr. Perfect has not lost an event this season. Sheesh. Switch. I would switch. And that right there is a pipe rider's worst nightmare. Yeah, that was a really, really bad slam. And this is definitely one of those moments where we rely on the fact that we have an incredible medical team that will be attending to him immediately. You okay? Wait a minute, I really just <laughs> my head. And just like that, we got a new so leader. Yuto's been fighting for this all year. I've okay. seen him, I've seen him finish second next to Scotty and he's not happy with that. Knowing what we know about Scotty James and the finals run that he has and seeing what Yuto Tatsuka did today, is Scotty James still the favorite going into Saturday? Oh, morning guys, how are we? Uh, Good Peck, athlete manager, just picking up my credential for this week. Thank oh, you. right on, dude. Yeah. Right on. Oh. Who's the athlete you're here for? Scotty James. Actually. Scotty James, dude, one of our favorites, world champ. Yeah, absolutely. Sick. Um, my name should be down on the list. I've got a, I've got a couple people under Scotty. I'm not seeing a. Maybe I'm spelling it wrong. Yeah, so Quinton, so Q U I. Q U I. N T O N. N O T O N. Yeah. What is it that you do? You're the wax tech. Is that what you said? So I'm a manager. Um, so I, you know. I, Let me just see if I can. Uh... I will need something. I will need some sort of. Hey guys, I've got a Qu Quentin Prick here for Scotty James. He's an athlete support. I'm not really getting. 
that's I'm not really hearing anything yeah, back. Um, um, so what can we do? That's that's the question that I'm asking. Got a lot of credentials here that do a lot of things, and I'm just not super sure on what kind of access I want to give you. So you sort of like a like a girlfriend. So I feel like I was breaking it waist a little bit on the backside nines and started doing that switch back as well. Yeah, it's but. just it's a smaller training, so you just really got to get more compact, load the board up, and yeah. really just. Uh, hey, sorry, my phone's ringing. Turn around. What? No way. Scotty. Clinton. <laughs> James. It's Clinton. <laughs> Surprise. Wait, I'll come up. Sam. Professional. He's been doing it for 25 years, so he yeah. knows what he's doing. Don't have to stress. T-Bird, he's all right. Tina, looks here as well, okay, so shouldn't be any problems. The pride of Warren Day, Australia, the one and only Scotty James, mate. Thank you so much uh, for joining us. Thank you for having we me. We got lots of questions. We've seen you at competitions, but this year you've just been on a roll. So what has changed? What's different about your training? You know, it's been an awesome year for me. I'm very grateful for uh, to be standing up top of the podium, um, but yeah, just really worked quite hard off season and uh, spent a lot of time on the board in the summer, and uh, it's been paying off. You've won four comps in a row. Uh, oh, oh, sorry, sorry. We'll just actually so. Excuse me. It's actually five, five comps in a row. Can we just, can we just take that again? Actually, that'd be, no. I, sorry, just five, five in a row. It's not four. It's five. Five. Sorry, five contests. Yeah. In a row. Yeah, it's been. Uh, Got five in a row. Um, you know, this this week would be six, so it would be uh, really awesome. And you know, do you feel pressure? Not heaps of pressure. More pressure, maybe just on myself. But uh, you know, I just go out there and do the best I can and snowboard the way that I that I like to and hope for the best. What I'd really like to know too, Scotty, is we know so much about you when you're strapped into your snowboard. Uh, what about life off the hill? Is there is there a special certain someone in your life? Well, hold on. Okay, hold on. T-Bird. Uh, you like standing we're, we're in front doing, of the camera. We're not doing personals. I've said this before, T-Bird, okay? I'm so tired. Ready for the light? Out to sick. I'll just get everything sorted. Ready now? Yeah, ready to go. Scotty. Yeah. I'm proud of you. Thanks, Becky. No, no. I <laughs> um What was I gonna ask you? Nothing. Nothing. I don't even know why you're here if I'm honest. Yeah, well, I'm not actually sure why I'm here either. I could, uh, I could use a nap. Yeah, Sparky. Yeah, Sparky. Sparky. Oh, he's a beautiful man, isn't he? Huh? He's a beautiful man. Yeah, how's this one looking? That looks pretty al dente, that one. Great, let's give this a try. Mmm, how is it? Delish, okay. I'd love to get some runs in, try to get in that pipe. Try to, I uh, actually got above the lip yesterday on the pipe, did like a head high air. You know what I mean, head high. <laughs> so, 